Okay, now we're going to work on counting objects, okay? So let's look at these frogs. How many frogs do we have? One, two, three. Three frogs. How many oranges do we have? One, two, three, four, five. Now, which one has the most? Which one has the most? Very good. The oranges has the most. Now, we're going to do another one. Okay. Now, we have some balloons and we have some flowers. Let's start with the balloons. Let's count the balloons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we have ten balloons. One, two, three, four. And we have four flowers. Which one has the most in it? Very good. The balloons have... The balloons have the most. Very good. All right. Now we're going to try to figure out which one has the least. Okay. So we have some fish and we have tomatoes. Let's count the fish. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we have six fish. Let's count the tomatoes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we have eight tomatoes. Now, which tomato, which one has the least? The fish has the fewest amount. Very good. Now, this guy is going to put three objects up there. Here's the first one. Here's the second one. And here is the third object. Okay, so if I say which one shows nine, what you would have to do is you would have to count each picture to see which picture shows nine okay so let's count and see let's count the oranges one two three four five does that show nine no so it is not the answer let's count the tomatoes one two three four five six seven eight does that show nine so no it's not the answer let's count the leaf one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes, it shows nine. So this is our answer. And parents, if you have flashcards, you can continue this skill or you can make your own flashcards and just draw circles or something simple on index cards to continue this skill. Okay? All right. Bye-bye.